hair floss too. It's mini and all excess. I know it's been a while, but I've guess I've got lots of lots of stuff to show you. Um, some of you may already know. Uh, this past weekend, I was in Cincinnati, Ohio, for 2024 StitchCon. <sighs> glorious, glorious, glorious weekend. Okay, I have whips and stuff to share with you from a month ago. But I want to do this, uh, the StitchCon, um, wrap up or stitch can share my stitch con experience with you so I'll do that first and maybe next week we'll do the uh, the 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 catch up on all my whips and everything else so I think it's a lot so I'm going to get started so this video does not run all day long so I'm going to get started now there has been I think six stitch cons six or seven I haven't missed one yet even with me being sick and I still managed to be well enough and actually go to stitch con last year and I went back again this year and hopefully I'll get in for next year so let me first start off with, I'm going to show you our bag. This is a, a beautiful bag. It's huge. It carries a holds a lot of stitching and purchases. Great bag. We also got an oat jar. With the symbol of the state of Ohio. Uh, again, we were visited by a representative from uh, Just Cross Stitch Magazine. They, this is the uh, summer issue is included in the in the bag. It's one of my freebies. I believe this was in the bag. If not, it was one of my giveaways. It's a beautiful little tag with a little spool on it. I love it. Uh, this is from Happy Stitching from your friends Mary Lang and April Skipper. Stitcher 211 and April Skipper. Okay, so no, this was probably one of my giveaways. I got it in the wrong section. Okay. I try to pull everything out so I can go through that category. This is a scissor fob that was in our bag. This is keepsakes. I love it. Stitch Con 2024. That's keepsakes. I'm not sure. I think this was in a free given given to us in our bag. I believe. This is a chart from Silver Needle or Bent Creek. This is each day. Okay. Of course, we got our book, our notebook. I love that. I love those pens and notebooks from StitchCon. I have every one of them. And of course, we had our passport which gave us all the information that we needed to know about uh, what was going on in StitchCon and there was a fundraiser where you could get autographs from the, all the designers and dyers and um, thread dyers and fabric dyers designers that wanted to be uh, help with the fundraiser you get the autograph and get pictures I have pictures they'll come at the end okay so that's uh, that was all the um, the goodies in the goodie bag okay now I'm going to start with um, 
Some items I picked up off the freebie table. Now, I had a bag of items. Sorry, didn't want stuff to fall. I had a bag of items actually that I took with me and put on the freebie table. But of course, you know, stuff kind of, you know, jumped out at me, so I had to take it, bring it home with me. But it wasn't as much as I put on the freebie table. This is a magazine. Um, my friend Jan, as soon as she saw this, this angel, she knew it was for me. So she pulled it for me. I saw this Borgello, Bar Bargello crab. That's a chart. I like that. So I pulled that one. I thought this was cute from Sue Hillis. Beer helping men to dance since 1862. I thought that was cute. Um, this one is Wintertide Cardinal. It's artfulofferings.com. It's a cardinal. I like it. And it came with the fabric. So I got that. I found another piece of fabric. This is a it says Northern Cross Linen in cream, 35 count. It's on the freebie table. And some little emery boards, fig nail. Always need those. You always get a snake. Okay. Uh, giveaway gifts. Let me see. What else? Where is. Okay, what, oh, I have, I have, I'm telling you, I have, I have stuff everywhere. Okay, there is candy treats. I get some library card uh, project. You can put them on the back of your project, like on your frame, something, you put it on the back of it. Um, I get uh, uh, somebody was doing has been making uh, froggets, frogging tools, froggers, just like the ones that I make, and I get one of theirs. I get a flying chicken from Rebel Stitcher. That was cute. I get some floss drops from JBW Designs. Very nice. I get this little goodie package from... I can't tell who it's from. Ooh, and needle minders. That's great. That's pretty. This is from... I don't know who this was actually from, but it's a great little item bag. I got a little frog that's supposed to be my lucky frog to help keep the bed frogs away. I get scissor fobs and counting pins. I get another little brush to get rid of all the little fuzz when you're when you're frogging. I got a ruler. I get pins. Oh I get it. I have a waxer. I got all kinds of goodies. Let's see what else. I got a chart. Got this chart. I got a sample of fabric from a new fabric dyer. This is Millennial Fabrics. You can go online, look up Millennial Fabrics. I get a kit. It's all it's all kitted up. It's this design, and it's all kitted up. I want I don't want to show you because I don't want to show the chart. 
let's see what else I get a turning tool this was given to me by Stashaby. It's a pointed, uh, like a chopstick pointer, but you can turn it out, turn out corners. No more counting pins. Another scissor fob. And another scissor fob. Another scissor fob. I got a measuring tape. A sticker, stickers, and floss drops. I get a um, coaster handmade by Allison Nor Norris, Alley Cat 13. Thank you. I get some needle minders. These were from Jan and Helen. My table mates and local stitchers and Helen actually made this bag I love it somebody was giving away flosses so I got a few flosses I got some DMC um, 310 and 420 and 433 434 so I have flosses, I have charts, all kinds of goodies. And that's what happens at StitchCon. Everybody wants to share. You have, you don't even have to get out of your seat. People come around and they bring you gifts. And then you can get up and you go and you can pass out your gifts. It's not required. Is you don't have to do any of this, but everybody in the stitching community is so, uh, they like to share with you, and it's just, it's like a big family. You know, when you get around family, what do you do? You have a good time, you share gifts, um, you're visiting, you haven't seen each other for a year. So, we share. Okay. Oh, uh, let's see. What else did I get? I get, oh, my exchange gift. Oh, I'll have to put you in, put a picture in of what I gave out as a, my exchange gift. It's gone now, so I don't have, a, I can't show it to you. Um, but I have some pictures of it. Now I have to put them in somewhere here. And I received this beautiful bag okay I've crunched it up so it's not it's not as fancy as it was but it has vines on it the bag has actually has vines and inside there were flowers and I received a notions pouch it's quilted. It's so cute. From Nana K. I get some almond MM silk. This is called Wicket. It's beautiful. Purples and greens. So that's perfect. I love that. I got a bracelet charm. Has the mother of pearl in it.
That's beautiful. And I haven't even gotten to the the stitch piece yet. I've got also got some more uh, floss. You never have too much white, black and white floss. And like I said, I haven't even got to the to the stitch piece yet. It's going to completely blow your mind, as it did mine. This is so beautiful. This is my piece that I received. I don't know how well you can see, but look at the stitches. All of the fancy stitches, specialty stitches around the border. You get the charms, you've got the floss, you get beads. I mean, it has a little bit of everything, and it is gorgeous. Look at this detail. I love it. I love it. Thank you so much. Thank you. It's beautiful. And the card. This is the card that was in there. Isn't that beautiful? Everything is floral. Flowers and vines. It's beautiful. This is, I have a chatelaine. So K Warren, thank you very much. It's beautiful. And it will be going up on my wall. Once this video, once I'm done recording and getting my video set up. Okay. Alright, so that was my exchange gifts. I love them. Okay. Oh, now this year I I didn't. Let's see. Is this crooked? Okay. I didn't ride with the um, local ladies this time. My husband actually drove me to Cincinnati. It was a um. It was an experience that. I think he had a good time, but I don't think he'll be doing it anytime soon again. But he went around and he went sightseeing and he went to, he went to, um, it's the National Underground Railroad Freedom Center in Cincinnati. And he purchased me, for me, the Harriet Tubman doll. I love this. I love it. I think it is beautiful. Now I can sit this near my uh, Harriet Tugman cross stitch piece. And there you go. So I got that. And he also went to Disney. There's a Disney outlet, I think, in one of the malls. And of course, I got my name on a mug. My, I love mugs, and you also get this. Uh, you also get this bag, and it's a portable bag. You can use it, and then you fold it. <coughs> Excuse me, and you can put it back up. So I get that. I get this gift. This was given to me. I also get this mug with my name on it from Deb, Deb Rucker. Thank you, Deb. Thank you very much. I love it. Put those back there so they won't get broke. Okay. Let's see. Uh, 
Okay, you want to get into some purchases. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't buy a lot. When I left, I said I was not going to buy any fabric because I had enough. But there was a there was some fabric there that just had to come home with me and some floss. I did get a little notepad. It says stitch con. Because I always need notes when I'm when I'm watching videos and you know a new chart comes up. I have to write it down somewhere. Okay, I got four flosses that I had to fight people over almost because they wanted to, well, at least one of them, they wanted to hijack my, my, my silk. This one was, this is, this is Into the Woods. This is Almond m and m Silks. And let me just get my board here. So you can see this beautiful, uh, the color on this, this floss is just, uh, to die for. Okay, this is, this one is Into the Woods. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my God. That is so pretty. It looks like velvet. It looks like velvet, okay, and it feels just, oh, you know how silks are, and these are so beautiful. This one is Burnt Mellow. This one is Bumblebee. And this one is 1965. Gorgeous skin tone. A gorgeous skin tone color. So these are the four silks that I bought. Gorgeous. So now I'll be able to put all my stuff up and or you can start using my purchases. Now I found this. These are the charts that I purchased. This one is a Jeanette Douglas. It's Chubby Fox. The chubby bee I gave away to uh, with my um, exchange gift. This is chubby fox. This is his eye is on the sparrow. I love this, and he watches me. <laughs> Excuse me. This is singing sparrow. This is sweet wing sweet wing studio. Love it. Another from another one from Sweet Sweet Wing Studio is Give It to God. Not that. Lucy Bean, this is stubborn. Pray for me, I'm stubborn. This is from Erica Michaels. The Salty Mermaid. No, I love my mermaids. And here's a welcome. That's what got me. And of course, this is the exclusive StitchCon 2024 design from. It says, Come to the Garden. From by Sue Hillis. And this is 
the setting for our, pic our pictures, our photographs. We hit the full life size setting. I'll, I'll put that picture in, in with my pictures at the end. But you probably have seen it on Instagram already. So those were some of my purchases. Those are my, my charts that I purchased. And I'll show you the fabric that I really didn't want to buy. But it just had to come home with me. The first one is... This is a... It says Muted Sedona. This is a 32 count Lugana from Fiber on the Whim. I think it's gorgeous. And that's that's pretty much the the ex exact color. I love it. I love it. Yeah, these these just jumped out at me. I had to get them. This one is sweet. 32 count uh, Belfast linen. And this is Fiber on the This is sweet. That's a great neutral. Then I get. Uh, 32 count Belfast linen. This is called Coco. And this is fiber on the whim. I love this color. It is gorgeous. Let's see. There we go. Isn't that gorgeous? Just gorgeous. This I, th I don't think I've have I've ever had any fiber on the whim fabrics in there. This is good. I like this. This is another Lugana. It's Cappuccino from Fiber on William, 32 count. Even weave. Beautiful. Beautiful. I love it. Okay, and this one is Atomic Ranch fabric. It's called it's called Pumpkin King. I don't know why, but that's the color that it's that's what it's marked. But and I love the color. And this is what oh, this is what it looks like. Oh, isn't that now the color is a little bit darker, more of a reddish instead of the orange. It looks orange on the camera, but I love that. Don't you just love that? Halloween, Halloween, something Halloween. -y. Yes, this is 32 count, um, 32 count linen from Atomic Ranch. And the only other thing that I purchased, purchased besides uh, the raffle tickets that, um, I didn't win anything on was a t-shirt. This was a t-shirt from last year that was dyed by Atomic Ranch. And they didn't, they didn't, these were just, there was a few of them left over. So what they did was they made t-shirt bags out of them. So they sewed and boxed the, the ends. So now it's a bag. And this was another part of the fundraiser. You could either, you could buy one of these, or I think they had oh they had the Stitchy Bus T-shirts, but I already had one, so I bought the bag instead. And that was another uh, donation for the the service project this year, which was to buy beds for sleepyheads, which is the organization that furnishes uh, helps uh, people with. Uh, like first time people with their first time first apartments that don't have any furniture they help furnish um, help them furnish their 
their their you know apartments and they pro help provide beds for children you know families that don't have actual beds you know you never know they there was the representative told us a story that how she would go into to Starbucks and pick up her you know coffee every day and you know talk to the barista not knowing that this lady was coming to work every day but when she went home she slept on the floor with her children which is just ridiculous so they started an organization that they want to provide beds and that's what the service project but this is the one that Barbara chose for this year the service project and from what I from what I hear Weekend A raised like mm, thirty something thousand, thirty one thousand dollars. So there's gonna be quite a few bids, and that's just weekend A. So weekend B, make sure you take your wallet with you. That's all I'm saying. Okay, so there was some stitching going on at StitchCon. I finished. I have a fin StitchCon finish. It is hip hop, the hip hop origins from Shaded Stitchery. I finished it and I got to ring the bell. I'll put a picture in at the end. But that's it. Isn't it beautiful? Now I just have to decide who I'm going to send this to either my son or my daughter because they both want one. So I may have. I, I'm going to have to stitch it again. But I love it. Very good. Good job, Nuri. Shady Stitcher, you did a good job on the, the design. Okay. Let's see. What else did I have? Oh. Um, okay. I had a... Nope, that's not it. Where's my new start? There we go. For StitchCon, I always try to have a, a new start for StitchCon. And it seems how June is my birthday month. So this is my birthday and StitchCon new start. And I was stitching it and I was missing uh, what, three colors and my friend Deb was going to, she's going to stitch the same well she actually I'll show you what it is this is the Birmingham sampler from Rebel Stitcher and the model was actually stitched by Deb Rucker, Rucker. But she's going to stitch it again for herself. And she was kidding it up. And so she was ordering her, her floss. And she picked up the, the three I was missing. She picked those up for me. So thank you, Deb. Appreciate it. And I stitched on this all the way home. Well most of the way home from Cincinnati and this is my new start you have to excuse the, the floss because I was working on it this is my new start and this is where it's at this uh, fabric is Picture this plus legacy 32 count Lugana. And like I said, this is the chart. The Birmingham sampler. And it features the names of the three, four, four young ladies who died in the bombing of the Baptist Church in Birmingham in 1963. 
These were all little four little girls at church. So in memory of them, this is my new start, new start, a stitch con, and my birthday month. So I'll be working on it this month, the rest of, on and off the rest of this month. I had some, uh, let's see, I worked on, I worked on my sampler for Sealy. This is where it's at. And nope, that was the only one I worked. Only two. These are the only ones I worked. I finished up the uh, hip hop origins. And I worked on Simple Facili and I started my my uh, my new start. And that was all I had for uh worked on at StitchCon. Um so what I'll do now is I'll add I enjoyed myself, I really did, and I have to say it, Barbara and all of the StitchCon staff. You are fantastic. I appreciate it. I enjoy myself. Well, I enjoy myself every year. I wouldn't keep coming back. But I really enjoyed it. You did a good job. And I will see you again next year. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, thank you to Pam and Steph. It was nice seeing you. Thank you, uh, Sue Hillis. I appreciate you stopping by and coming back and talking to me. Uh, Nicole, bless you. I love you. Thank you for coming back to, to see me and talk to me. Um, let's see, some of the other people I saw. Uh, uh, Candy, the 614 Stitcher. I saw Deb, the Sunshine Stitcher. Uh, she was representing. Uh, let's see, who else? Almond m, &M. I, I saw her. Uh, let's see, I saw Jesse Marie, who Jesse Marie does stuff. I saw um, Liz Matthews. Um, hmm. Who else? My brain is, you know, I, I can't remember a whole lot of stuff. So, and names really, I'm really bad with names. But I appreciate all of the people who watch my videos. Thank you so much. I wouldn't be doing them. Uh, without you being faithful subscribers and watching me every time I post one. So thank you all so much. I really do appreciate you. Um, let's see. What else can I tell you? Um, in this description box below, you'll find my email. If it's anything you want, if you know you need something, or you want me to share a picture of your work on my videos, send it to me in an email, and I'll put it up and show it. Um, I have a coffee, buy me a coffee link. It's in the description box below. Um, if you're interested, you could go to PNB Making Memories on Etsy. I have a needle minder. That's my all access needle minder. You can now get the corner gauges. And also your floss keepers. So that's PNB making memories on Etsy. Uh, if there's any questions you have, leave them in the comments and I'll get back to you and answer your questions as soon as possible. So for now, I'm going to let you, I'm going to put in the pictures. I'm going to let you enjoy the exchange videos, uh, the brag table. Oh, the break table was fantastic. Wait till you see that. Uh, and some of my my photos from 
uh, visiting with my old friends. So until next time, be safe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.